that is a garlic gorgeousness. And it smells so good. So I'm gonna take fresh thyme, place it at the bottom of the ramekins, especially because I'm using tiny ramekins. So I wanna make sure the flavor really gets in there. <laughs> and then we take our garlic and we peel the garlic. And this is gonna take forever. <laughs> Whenever I have to peel mass amounts of garlic, I love to use this rubber garlic roller. Do not let my face fool you. It is actually really easy to use and it makes garlic so much easier to peel. I got it off of Amazon, but again, I am not sponsored. So once you have all your garlic in your ramekin, make sure you fill it up with the oil of your choice. I happen to be using olive oil. Uh, don't be like me though, and don't overfill it because I tend to do that. Next, you're gonna wrap everything up in foil. But again, when you do this, you can be using a bigger pot or a smaller pot. You can be using something miniature sized like me in this tiny ramekin. You're gonna put it in your oven, or as you see me doing the toaster oven, it just makes it a little bit more manageable. You set it to 350 and you're gonna leave it for an hour. After that, take it out. Do not forget to use your gloves. As you see, I have the most wonderful gloves here. They are super stylish and I use them anytime I have to take anything out of the oven. Then you lose the gloves and you take off your foil. You're gonna be left with this beautiful bubbling garlic masterpiece that you're gonna to wanna to put on everything. Gorgeous. It's gorgeous! <laughs> As I've shown you in my avo toast video, I absolutely love to use this confit garlic as the base on my toast right before I put the avocado on top. It's smooth, it's creamy, and it spreads just like butter. Another way I love to use my confit garlic is when I'm looking to take my instant ramen to the next level. Yes, I love instant ramen, and yes, I add confit garlic to it. It makes it sweet, it makes it savory, it really just brings it to a whole nother level. Another way I love to use it, I'll literally just plop it on top of a burger. Whatever burger you're eating, it'll change the game.